Imagine. Imagine seeing like this. Now imagine hearing this. Or this. Or even have a balcony with a spectacular view, but you don't know what it looks like. Now, imagine this is yours and you still don't know what it looks like. It's not because you don't want to, but because you can't, because you are blind. Imagine, and let's put aside for a second one's individual wish to choose not to see, which, by the way, I highly respect, but just to have the option to choose whether you want to see or not. This is 3D printed. This technology 3D printing helps to get a 2D picture into a 3D object like this. So blind people can feel the object. You see, this is a 2D picture. You cannot feel how this looks like, but with 3D technology, you are able to kind of extract this 2D picture into a 3D object, like this one. And this you can touch and feel and you can get a sense of, how, of the forms and, and how it looks like. And this 3D printing technology is exactly what Mom Taylor said has been life changing. So ambitious and generous doctors made the extra effort to make a 3D printing out of a ultrasound scan of Taylor's stomach in order for her to feel her baby's face. But there is more in sight. So scientists in Melbourne This is Australia, here is Melbourne. That's where the scientists are. have produced the first of its kind device that can restore one's vision with the help of with the help of a combination of microelectrodes and smartphone like electronics this new technology would be able to bypass the damaged optic nerve that are often responsible for what's defined as technical clinical blindness. So basically what they do is they plant a camera here, have a processing unit somewhere, and then transfer this processed information directly to the brain, somewhere here in the visual cortex. Just basic. This is exciting and everything, but foremost, it's very, it's a very meaningful development. Also, Elon Musk is working on some similar technology. Now, imagine that there is not only one solution, but two or four or many. But for now, let me enjoy some. Some pizza. Today is pizza day. And cute animals. 
Cute animal videos proven to reduce heart rate and blood pressure, meaning that anxiety rates went down by as much as 50% in some individuals. Links are in the description down below. Bye! Now imagine how much you can see for the first time.